As we just heard a few minutes ago, it seems like everyone has an iPhone, and apparently there's an app for everything. But are we becoming too dependent on this new technology and these fancy gadgets? Do they hold all of our common knowledge and old information? Are we losing our collective wisdom? Centuries ago, seafarers and others did need these gadgets. They used the sun and the stars to find their way. So, to prevent you from losing your way in this technological world, I wanted to show you a few simple tricks of how you can find your way just by using the sun and the stars. Now, at daytime, you use the sun. It rises in the east and sets in the west, moving across the sky in an arc. Around noon, it's at its highest and due south. And any time between, or before or after noon, you can still find south if you know the time. Just point the hour hand of your watch towards the sun, and south will be halfway between the sun and the 12 o'clock position. At night, you don't even need to know the time. The stars will lead the way. You just need to find the right one. Stella Polaris. Stella Polaris is Latin and means the pole star, also known as the North Star. As the name suggests, the North Star is located directly above the pole, and so it doesn't move. The rest of the sky rotates around the North Star, while the North Star stays stationary, <coughs> always due north, all through the night. I want to show you a few pictures and, and videos to better explain and, and show what I mean. As you can see in this photo by Martin Sherlock, the North Star is at the center of the rotation of the night sky. In this video by Alan Dyer, you can see the North Star at the very top in the middle, and how the night sky rotates slowly around it. As you can see, it's not a very bright star. And it doesn't rotate this fast in normal life, so you need a few help, a few tricks to find the star. This is another another video by Alan Dyer. North Star is still at the top, slightly to the right. Now the night sky does actually move quite fast. If you are outside at a at a party like last night, you can actually see how the planets and the stars move from the beginning of the party towards the end. But there's a simple trick to find the North Star. Locate the Big Dipper, and then you extend the far edge of the Dipper cup upwards until you find the North Star. So in this video by <coughs> John Glass, can you find the Big Dipper, and then extend it upwards and find the North Star? Now this is moving quite fast, so it's still very simple. But this is how you do it. This is how you can use the stars to find your way, without any gadgets, without any apps. So when you go out tonight and look up at the, star, at the stars in the sky, and they're stationary like this, will you be able to find the Big Dipper and, by extension, the North Star? If you can, you'll never lose your way again. Thank you.